Hello my viewers, this is Chaudhary Mahmood Anwar and welcome back to my research and statistics education channel. In this lecture, I will guide you how to conduct hierarchical regression modeling with control variables in JASP statistics software. Now I will conduct the analysis in JASP. This is the data file in JASP. We have the ID number of uh, samples so in this analysis uh, we have a sample size of uh, 224 GPA is our dependent variable whereas math scores science scores and English scores are our independent variables we are not using set M and set V in this example we will use sex variable as our control variable. Now we will conduct the analysis. Click on analysis button. Click on regression. Now click on linear regression. This is the regression window. On the left side you will find all the variables Now you need to put these variables into their respective boxes. Shift GPA to dependent variable because GPA is our dependent variable. And math scores, science scores and English scores to the covariate box because these are our independent variables. We will use the enter method for this regression analysis. Now the regression analysis has been performed. You can see this is uh, the model summary. This is for null hypothesis and this is alternate hypothesis. The R square for this model is 0 0.205. It means that 20.5% variance of dependent variable is explained by the independent variables. This is the ANOVA result. You can see that uh, the overall regression model is significant at 0 0.001 with the F value of 18.861. Now let's see the impact of uh, each independent variable on dependent variable. See math has a significant impact on uh, gpa the t value is 4.729 with the significance value of 0 0.001 whereas science scores and english scores are insignificant the coefficients are insignificant so we will conclude that the math scores have an impact on gpa math score contribute towards GPA whereas science and English scores do not have any impact on GPA. Now I will include the sex variable which is a nominal variable into factor box and let's see what happened. Again this is the model summary. Again you can see that 20.5% of the variance has been explained by the independent variables which is similar it means that sex has no impact on uh, the dependent variable let's see sex the impact of sex is insignificant the significance value is 0.917 so sex does not contribute to the dependent variable GPA now I will test the partial effects of variables or the variables you want to control and check the impact of the variables other than the control variables. For this you have to click on model and the variable you want to control you need to add that variable to the null model. For instance we want to control for sex and uh, maths these two variables we need to control. Just click on statistics box and click on 
R square change so that we may analyze the R square change of both models. Here is the outcome. You can see that uh, now in null model the math and sex are included. Overall R square is 0.191 it means that 91.1% is explained by maths and sex variables whereas for h1 the r square is 0 0.205 the r square change is 0 0.014 what does it mean it means that only 1.4 percent of the variance is explained by science and english scores as we already know that these two variables are statistically insignificant in the model here you can see these both variables are statistically insignificant but the only variable that is significant is the math variable therefore the math variable impact has been shifted to the null model which is 0.191 or 19.1 percent and it is significant at 0.001 in this lecture, you learn how to conduct hierarchical linear regression in JASP and how you can analyze control variables in JASP. I hope you will find this tutorial very easy to understand. Thank you very much for joining me today. Are you tired of rejection of your academic scholarship? Submit your research to International Journal of Management, Economics and Social Sciences. With us, you will experience a reputable publishing platform that will guarantee high-quality peer review. Our unique mentorship program enables you to develop your research to increase the chances of publication. Our editors are eminent researchers who will provide the much-needed impetus for your academic works. Visit www.ijms.com and get your work published.